This Sunday, Detroit's Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure will be held on Belle Isle. It's an inspirational event that's also a critically important fundraiser when it comes to breast cancer research. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here to explain how it's helping scientists better understand the disease. Yeah, Pam and Karen, you know, it is a key question that scientists have long sought to understand. Why does breast cancer metastasize or spread in some women, but not in others? Well, a new study suggests part of the answer may be hidden not in the breast itself, but in the gut. Inside our stomach and intestines are a collection of microorganisms known as the gut microbiome. The mix can be healthy or unhealthy, and new research finds that could impact the risk from breast cancer. What we found was is that having an unhealthy gut microbiome actually changed the breast tissue even before the tumor was present. Dr. Melanie Rutkowski and her team at the UVA Cancer Center found an unhealthy gut makes it easier for breast cancer to spread. It's kind of setting the stage so that when a tumor is there, it's got all of the resources it needs now to metastasize to other parts of the body. Rutkowski hopes their work can ultimately help doctors identify which patients are at higher risk for their cancer to spread. We hope that in the long term, you know, we can use some of our findings to develop more tailored therapies to prevent metastatic disease. In the meantime, the study highlights the importance of keeping the gut healthy. That includes a diet rich in whole grains, fruits, vegetables, yogurt with probiotics, fermented foods, and honey. Regular exercise, reducing stress, and not smoking can also help. Rutkowski says funding from Susan G. Komen has made her research possible. They're identifying some of the um, you know most innovative research that they can, and they're funding that. And I think that that's the way you know to move it forward, leaps and bounds in terms of identifying a cure. Now, it is really so vital to support this type of fundamental cancer research. Now, the Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure is going to be held this Sunday morning on Belle Isle. Local 4 is going to be there live all morning, and you can find all of the details to sign up and run or walk or just make a donation on the health page at clickondetroit.com. And, Doc, this study looked at breast cancer specifically, but what do we know about the gut and what it may be able to tell us about other types of cancers? Well, you know, actually, there is other research that suggests that it could help with other cancers. Studies have also found having a more diverse set of microorganisms in the gut improved the effectiveness of certain cancer treatments. So it's definitely an exciting field of study that actually could have wide-ranging impacts. There's so much attention on the gut. Mm -hmm. It really is. And, you know, it's a large portion of our body, yeah, and our, the microorganisms actually actually play a critical role that we are now just beginning to investigate. All right. Thank you, Doc. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it.